Good morning and welcome to Rising Star Baptist Church on this beautiful day. It's great to see everyone here and welcome also to those who are watching on Facebook this morning. I'm going to read scripture led prayer this morning and I will be reading from the book of Isaiah chapter 55 verses 6 through 12. Seek the Lord while he may be found. Call upon him while he is near. Let the wicked forsake his way and the unrighteous man his thoughts. Let him return to the Lord that he may have compassion on him and to our God for he will abundantly pardon. For my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are your ways my ways, declares the Lord. For as the heavens are higher than the, than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. For as the rain and the snow come down from heaven, and do not return there, but water the earth, making it bring forth and sprout, giving seed to the sower and bread to the eater. So shall my word be that goes out from my mouth. It shall not return to me empty, but it shall accomplish that which I purpose and shall succeed in the thing for which I sent it. For you shall go out in joy and be let forth in peace. The mountains and the hills before you shall break forth into singing, and all the trees of the field shall clap their hands. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, Lord God, we come to you once again in the name of Jesus, Father God. Lord, we come to the throne of grace. We rejoice today, Father God. We worship you. We come to worship you today, Father God. Lord God, we just thank you. We just want to say thank you once again today. We want to say thank you that you got us up today, that you brought us here today, Father God, to worship you, Lord God. Lord God, and we seek you today, Father God. We seek you while you still may be found, Father God. We thank you, Lord God, that you can be found. Father God, we thank you, Lord, that you haven't rejected us, Father God. You haven't abandoned us, Father God. You haven't turned your back on us, Father God. We praise your name, O oh God. We seek you, Lord God. We cannot seek you, Lord God, in our flesh, Father God, but by way of your spirit, Father God. We thank you, Lord, for your spirit, Father God. Lord God, that no one who speaks the Holy Spirit can say Jesus is accursed, and no one can say Jesus is Lord without the Holy Spirit. We just praise your name, oh God. We call upon you, Lord God. Lord God, we lean into you, Father God, and you incline your ear to us, and you will hear us, Father God. God, Lord God, and when we, when you gave us eternal life, Father God, Lord, you established an everlasting covenant with us, Lord God, that you cover us, and we thank you, Lord God. Lord God, and let us forsake our way, Father God. Lord, that we do not lean on our own understanding, Lord God. That we put that aside, Lord God. And Lord, help us, Father God. And Lord God, forgive us, please, of our sins, Father God. Forgive us, Lord, when we've missed the mark, Lord God. When we haven't done what you called us to do, Father God. Lord God, and let us take our thoughts captive, Father God. Lord, help us to imprison those wicked and unrighteous thoughts, Father God. God. Lord, help us, Father God. And Lord, that we can return to you, Father God. Lord, when we sin, Lord God, we can come to you, Lord God, and confess our sins. And you are faithful and just to forgive us our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness, God. Thank you, Lord God. And you show compassion on us, Lord God. And you will abundantly pardon us, Father God. Lord, the ultimate pardon was when you sent your only son, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross for our sins, to be buried and be resurrected from the dead oh God and Lord God you abundantly pardon you do it in large quantities Father God Lord that it is extreme pardon Father God we thank you Lord God you do it abundantly Father God and your thoughts are not our thoughts and our, and our ways are not your ways Father God Lord we lift you up for who you are Father God Lord you are beyond comprehension Father God you're unsearchable Father God Lord God that you are eternal Father God, 
You are good, Lord God. You've given us abundant grace, Lord God. Father God, you are holy. You are just. You are loving, Father God. You're omnipotent. You're omnipresent. You're omniscient, Father God. You're righteous, Father God. Lord God, you are holy, Father God. You are sovereign, Father God. You are worthy, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father God. Lord God, that we just praise your name and as the rain and the snow come down from heaven and return to earth, Lord God, and you water the earth, Father God. Lord, so shall your word go forth and you will feed us with your word, Father God. Help us, Lord, to proclaim your word, Father God. And wherever it goes, Father God, and Lord God, you purpose it where you want it to go, Father God, and it shall never come back empty, Father God. And Lord God, that we go out in joy. Lord God, even in your word you say that, God, it all is joy, even the trials of life, even the various trials that we go through, and our loved ones go through, and our friends, Father God, and everyone, Father God, but Lord, that we trust in you, that we have faith in you, O oh God, and let us be let forth in peace, Lord God. Lord God, with all the chaos and the conflict and the confusion in this world, Father God, please, Lord, lay, lay, lead us in peace, Father God, and please give us the peace that surpasses all understanding. Let us be let forth in peace to proclaim your word, Lord God. We thank you for your unfailing word, Lord God. Lord God, your wonderful word, Lord God, and we just praise your name in the name of Jesus, Father God. Lord God, we just lift up this morning worship service to you, Lord God. We lift up the disciples of praise to you, Father God. Lord, that they sing for your glory, Father God. Sing with joy, Father God. Make melody to you today, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. And Lord, that the man of God is going to preach the word today. Let the words of his mouth and the meditation of his heart be pleasing in your sight. You are his rock. You are his savior. You are his redeemer, Lord. And we take what is said here and we apply it to our lives and we live godly lives, Father God, and use us for your glory. We just praise you. We give you thanks. We say hallelujah. We say holy, holy, holy to the most high God sitting up on the throne. We praise you. We thank you. In Jesus Christ's name, we pray and we give thanks. Amen and amen.